Hello guys, this is the second video on this day uh, that I promised I will put two videos in the same day so um, now uh, in this video I will uh, teach you how to optimize your Windows 10 uh, that run a little bit faster and much complex to say um, yes, let's get started uh, first thing first, let's go to settings up from Windows. So let's go here settings. Uh, from here, you'll have to go to um, uh, system, I think it was um, default apps. And from here, first thing first, you have to um, put your uh, default apps if you want to. Uh, from here you have to go to first things first personalization no from here no so let's see internet now devices now I think system it was um, uh, notifications app and features with testing Power and slave storage. I think power and slave. No. Um, I think account. No, accounts is my account. So no, channel language. No. Ease of access. No. Privacy. I think here it is. Yes, here. Oh. <laughs> okay, so. You go to privacy, and from here you have to go to your location, and to turn off your location and change here. Click on change and turn off. Probably turn off. After you go to camera, if you want to use your camera for only Skype, you if you want to okay. Um, if you didn't want, I think this is involved. So all of this you have to put off all your apps, um, but Skype no because the Skype is here. Okay. Microphone if you want to uh, get off of it. Okay. I will let it on because I will record now. Speech inking and typing. Uh, here's like um, a thing that Cortana allows you to uh, make. As you can see, if I now type to Cortana, to help out, I need speech inking and typing personalization to be on. As you can see, speech inking and typing. So uh, this will disable Cortana. So now let's go to settings and of Cortana to get off. And if you want to get the search online and include the web results on, but um, really, it's going like. No thanks. So you, if you click no thanks, no. Uh, when you reopen, don't get you get the news. But if you didn't want to get the news, you go to settings and turn off your search thing. Okay, to web. So you search Windows and search only Windows app. Okay. So like this, you can um, change the on. Oh, no, you can uh, disable or enable Cortana. Okay. Uh, after that, you go to contacts. Uh, here, nothing to do. Calendar, if you want to calendar, you can turn it off. Messaging, turn off. Radios, why not off? Because you didn't need. Other devices, I don't know. Um, if you want to sync, if you want to all of this, you can turn it off. I will keep it on. And background apps. 
here we have to disable all of our apps that runs on your background so yet of this i will turn it on because i want to upgrade to all of it 2016 microsoft igm uh, phone confirmation no because i don't know what is that with first um and if you want to disable apps disable it alarm calendar you didn't need it is on your pc so like this on our all from here and make sure your updates will install correctly i will retry this but okay uh the second thing is going to your PC, this PC and right click and properties and from here go to advanced system settings and it will bring up with this window uh, you have to go to advanced we are in advanced and here we we'll have uh, three uh, tabs here performance user profiles and startup and recovery you have to go to performance click settings and adjust for best performance if you click apply uh, what uh, make uh, what uh, does this make uh, your font will change so if I click again let Windows choose what happened oh uh, okay so what okay now it's uh, working I don't know why uh, my mouse wasn't working okay so as you can see now uh, the um, the um, the font is changed because I get if I get to let windows choose as you can see the font will change it as you can see it's changed and if I go to adjust for best performance you go to the font and as you can see it changed so we'll um, change your font will change like the selected things because if you go to let windows and apply as you can see it's this blue thing but if you go to adjust for best performance it will be like mm, transparency like a little lines that you can select um, and yes that's all and those uh, Pressuring things will disappear uh, only if you go to best performance as you can see this animation that makes if you want to keep that animation adjust for best appearance only uh, and uh, it will make like that but I will recommend you to get to adjust for best performance apply and after that okay and as you can see now all the stuff it will go not animation cortana will be but all of this stuff will be like no animation okay so you didn't have animation so yes if you like if you minimize this it will disappear completely not with animation to go from here to here you know those animation now let's close this um what else you have to do um I think this is all you have to do uh, only to go t oh, uh, to go to the test manager is like the same uh, Windows 8 uh, or 8.1 so if you were, was uh, Windows 8 or 8.1 user you will be frame rate late uh, now you go to startup and disable all of your apps that you didn't want to be enabled okay so all of these you have to get disabled okay this is enabled because I don't know why this not want it to be disabled it's an antivirus from the Beijing from the China man okay so you have to enable or disable what you want okay to not uh, open uh, those uh, things uh, with um, you know the background apps will stay on the background and all of this so you go to test manager start up and disable what uh, program you didn't want to start when you start the computer um, I think that was all uh, let's go to properties again I think it's one last 
thing that I um, um, oh here uh, you have to go to system protection configure and let's turn on the system protection if you didn't want the, the system protection turn off uh, but I will keep on and it is recommended to turn on your system um, can you create this if you want to create a restore point you can create this is another tutorial uh, the remote the remote tab allow remote and don't allow so you will have to get like this okay so okay computer name now hardware and I think this oh oh startup uh, system startup you have to go to your settings and here you have to uh, put in your seconds that you want to uh, to open up windows for mine is 15 seconds so you have First thing first, you have to um, uh, like uh, see how much uh, uh, does Windows take to boot up from the Windows loading to the open desktop, and after put your amount of seconds on this tab right here, okay? And yeah, that's all about it. Thanks for watching again, uh, and uh, see you to the next video. I don't know what, what will be the next video, but I will see you on the next video. Bye.